New United Nations climate report says climate change is affecting animals that migrate to warmer climates. And here in Indiana, these animals are facing changes and issues. News 8's Danielle Zolkowski is here now in studio to explain this issue. Danielle. Yes, well, global climate change is affecting our wildlife here in Indiana. Rising temperatures are confusing animals that fly south for the winter, and they're causing new species to move in. This has the potential to cause a ripple effect. Dan Bore is the executive director of the Indiana Wildlife Federation. He says animals that migrate evolved over millions of years, and climate change is moving too quickly for them to keep up. We have measurable changes in migration patterns on decade scales. Temperatures are rising by nearly a degree a decade in certain places, and it is essentially throwing a system that has to work in perfect harmony for success out of whack. Or it says warmer temperatures are causing earlier springs, meaning migratory animals could miss out on peak feeding and mating times. If they're getting there too late, the grass has already emerged, insects have already hatched and, and started to move away. They've missed kind of peak time for nourishment. Donna Reiner is a naturalist for the Eagle Creek Ornithology Center. She says throwing these systems out of order has ripple effects. So we need these animals to reduce our insect populations by consuming those insects and helping us with agriculture. They're also important seed dispersers, so our forests are going to change without the birds around. Donna McCarty is a volunteer at Eagle Creek. She says over the 48 years she's been bird watching at the park, she noticed a shift in birds moving north. Great egrets, we see them uh, a lot more than we used to. Used to be maybe in the late summer, fall, we'd get a few, but now some of them can be found year round in the state. On the other hand, some warblers that used to nest here uh, don't. This Sunday, McCarty will join other volunteers in the Audubon Christmas Bird Count and will help record how many and what kinds of birds live in the Eagle Creek area of Indianapolis. All so scientists have a better understanding of the bird populations. And it's not just wildlife in Indiana that are feeling the pressure of climate change. Sea creatures and other species are having some of the same issues that Indiana animals are facing. I'm Danielle Zulkowski for Wish TV, wishtv.com, and like us on Facebook.